All right, so I'm just a kid who wants a new 3DS, and <laughs> when I want um, a game, it's really simple. I just go inside the store and I come out, and it's that simple. However, when I got this console, it's the most stressful thing I ever experienced. Um, so I go to GameStop in Cerritos, and when I'm turning in my DS, they're like, oh, we can't accept this DS. I'm like, well, why not? And she's like, well, because the barcode's faded. I'm like, well, it's still functional. It still works. And the reason I'm turning it in is because they do a promotion where you turn in your older model and then you get the newer model for half off. I'm a broke kid, I got a gift card that's 100 bucks, of course I'm gonna take that deal. You'd be stupid if you didn't. So I go in and I'm getting mad at this lady because she doesn't want to accept my DS. So I'm like, okay, go home and I'm thinking, what shady thing I can do so I can get my stuff? And I'm like, hmm. I start remembering that behind the DS, there's a barcode. So I'm like, I'm just gonna swap them out. They're not gonna know. So I'm like, all right, so I go home and I start unscrewing the 3DS and one screw doesn't want to come out. Put it in the table, and I'm using so much force that it's not, it's not coming out. And I'm like, what the heck? Either I'm weak, or this screw is really stuck there. And I'm like, okay, I just give up. So now it's a day before the, it's a day before the, the release of the DS. And um, so I go to school, and I go to my girlfriend's house. And I go to my girlfriend's house, I'm telling her, hey, I'm gonna ask Kevin for help because um, he knows how to work with tools. I'm not a hand person with tools, so whatever. So once I arrive to his house, I'm like, hey, Kev, uh, can you help me out, dude? Like, I don't know why this screw is stuck there. He's like, oh, let me look at it. He starts looking at it, he's like, dude, were you effing around with this screw? I'm like, uh, yeah. I was like grinding the hell out of it. Well, it wasn't stuck. It seems that it used to have a cross, and now it's a circle. And the screw doesn't even have a shape no more. I'm like, oh, I just thought it was really stuck in there, man. So I'm like, so what can we do? And he's like, well, we're going to get a power drill. We're going to get the power drill. And it's power drill around the screw and hopefully chip it. And when we chip it, we're, gonna unscrew, we're just gonna plug it out with the tweezer. I'm like, okay, this is the equation I'm thinking. Power drill plus 3DS equals a hole through my DS. And I'm like, please, no. Is that the only option I got? He's like, yes, that's the only option. I'm like, all right, let's do it then. So I take the gamble, because I now want to pay $200 for a 3DS. So we take the gamble, and I'm there. And I'm like, oh crap, did I mess up my DS? Or, nope. It's a chip in the screw, pluck it out, great. So then I go to Downey this time. I go to Downey, I go to GameStop, and then she's like, oh, I go to the guy, and then I'm like, hey, can I pre-order a 3DS? And he's like, yeah, we actually have one more. You just have to line up outside for an hour, and I'll take your order. As I'm saying, there's a couple right behind me, and they storm out the room. And I'm like, please, no, 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 no. So I have the curiosity of asking them, like, hey, why are you guys uh, lining up? And they're like, oh, we're waiting for the last 3DS. No shit, I'm the one who asked. <laughs> so I go to the guy, I'm like, hey man, uh, so unfortunately this happened, and what, what can you do? He's like, well, let me check some delivery thing. I'm like, all right, cool. So he tells me to go to Newark Town Square. So I go to Newark Town Square, and then I go to the guy, and he's like, hey man, so look, Dario, that's the store manager. Um, I'm looking for a 3DS. Do you guys have one? He's like, yeah, you just have to line up outside for three hours, and we'll take your order. Seven o'clock, it's pretty cold. So I'm like, all right, I'm determined to get my DS. At this time, I want my red 3DS, not the ugly black one. So, <clears throat> once 10 o'clock comes, I go in, and I start paying, and he pulls his box, and it's the ugly black one. And I'm like, man, oh well, you know what, I'll take it this time, I'm just done with it. And um, so I got my DS, and I went home, I wasn't too excited about my DS, I got a game and all, but I just left it there. And so I was kind of sad, but the next day, I just go home, you know, go to school, I'm in philosophy class, it's 9 o'clock, I get a call, it's GameStop. And I'm like, hello, what's up, Dario? And he's like, uh, no one picked up their red 3DS, I was wondering if you want to exchange it. And I'm like, hell yeah, man, I'll be out over there. Just left school, and I'm over there. So. <laughs>